I don't know what I titled this video yet. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, That Chocolate Vegan with me, Erin Wells, and you read that title correctly. Today we're making sausage and pepper baked ziti. Let's get started. Now the reason I didn't want to make traditional baked ziti was because I didn't want to use ricotta because to me that seems like it was just going to be lasagna with a different noodle, plus ricotta is expensive and expensive to make, so I was like, <laughs> leave it out. I've also had this Beyond Sausage in my freezer for like a month now, waiting for a special occasion. And what's more special than you guys? All right, let's make this pasta. I'm not showing you how to make no pasta. No, I'm not. All right, guys, for this recipe, I'm gonna use about half of this large onion and um, how many cloves is this? One, two, three, four, five and a half cloves of garlic, okay? And I already cut up about hmm, three fourths of a green bell pepper that we're also gonna use in this recipe. All right, my stove is on medium, guys. Garlic. And let's start off with a cup of the chopped onion. One cup of the chopped green peppers. Let's make that two. Whole thing. I forgot to tell you guys, but I'm also gonna put in a cup of mushrooms. Mix that in there as well. Then I'm gonna season this with Italian seasoning and salt and pepper. Just go around the pan. Boom. Salt, same thing, around the pan. You can always add more. And let's crack some pepper. Now I'm gonna add in our sausage. I kind of like defrost these in the oven a little bit. We're just gonna cut these right on in there. I only cooked three. I just don't think any more is needed for this recipe. I'm gonna turn the stove to medium low and I'm gonna cover this for about five minutes and I'll be right back, guys. Ooh. Ooh, 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 do y'all see that? Let's get our pasta and then we will combine. I'm gonna take a little bit of this pasta out just in case it's too much. So let's take about two cups away. We can always add it back in. My stove is off. We're gonna add in our sausage mixture. Oh y'all, yes. Stir that on in there. Yeah, we definitely, I'm glad we took away some pasta. That was, we did not need all that. I am gonna give it a taste and see if it needs any salt before we add in our uh, marinara sauce. Nope, we don't because of the saltiness from the sausage. Yes, yes. I'm now gonna add in about three fourths of a jar of marinara sauce because I had spaghetti the other day. Boom. I'm gonna add a little bit of water to get it all out. You can of course add a whole jar, guys. I just didn't have a whole jar. It's not about the sauce as much anyway in this recipe. Give that a little mix. Yep, I switched spoons. Y'all not gonna try me because I tasted the last one. Y'all not gonna try me? No, you're not. <laughs> now these are not full bags of uh, mozzarella, so it's really one bag all together. This one's almost empty. You get it, but one bag of mozzarella, dia cheese, cutting board, because Publix still sells the original. Tried it. Add right on in there. Guys, I've already preheated my oven to 350, so it can be ready to receive our ziti. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I know you're excited too. Or maybe you don't care, I don't know, but you're watching the video. I'm gonna place a little bit of oil in our pan so our pasta does not stick. Brush that on in there. You can always use marinara sauce for this, but you guys know why I don't have any more. We're gonna put our pasta right on in there. That's all that's fitting, so I'm gonna eat this as is. <laughs> Now to top off our ziti, we're gonna be using Follow Your Heart Parmesan cheese. All right, I'm gonna place this in the oven for 20 minutes. All right guys, it is out of the oven. It's been 20 minutes exactly. Let this cool for a minute and then we're gonna dive in, yes. Are we in there? Oh, we in there! Oh, we in there! Yes! All right, my battery about to die. Uh, this is 
Christmas. <laughs> This is the lovely Shannon. Yes, How's you guys seen her several times. We're right. This is her breakfast. It is 3, 2 30 almost in the afternoon, y'all. And what is okay. this? What is this again? Um, this is so it's not traditional ziti. It is sausage and pepper. Oh. See, yeah, I'm gonna switch it up. I did that. That sausage. That, right? Oh, that sausage is delicious. Oh, that's good. It's soy free too. Oh my gosh, but so good. Mm-hmm. No, I don't have vegan mm -hmm. sausage every day, you know? Mm. But this? Yes. It all works together. Mm. And the cheese is so good. Oh my god. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, mm -hmm. I don't see the camera there. I'm just like. <laughs> it's okay, they get it. This is bomb, y'all. Mm, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. so good. Yeah. The only thing I would do differently, y'all, was maybe put more another bag of mozzarella cheese so it would bind better. Not for flavor, just for the um, binding. But this is good. Mm. This is so good. <laughs> like, like I don't know what else to we, say. I'm they so know we're not talking. Every time I have a taste test that doesn't talk, they're like, we get it. <laughs> That's when you know, no, we get it. Shannon's not even talking today. Mm -hmm. She's just digging in. Mm. Okay, y'all. We're gonna um keep doing this. I'm kidding. tried to flip the calendar and put it on the wrong I didn't just skipped all over April anyway um, I'm actually editing the video y'all are watching right now but I forgot to tell y'all bye so as always make sure you like comment and subscribe down below and I'll see you next time peace